Hey, this is Crypto Coding here, back with another goddamn video. In this video, you'll learn about how to create spikes. So, in, uh, it's really simple for you guys to understand this. But if you are not like familiar to good old programming and how JDScript works, it can be a little bit tough. So, if you are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe down below and turn on the bell notification if you don't want to miss any of my uploads. First of all, I want to say that uh, a spike is really, really simple. It just really reloads the scene. I don't want anything like now it's it can be applied to stuff that uh, if you hit something that it, if you hit something that does something that's what a area 2d comes in right so that's what a 2d is so you have two two of these so I'll demonstrate with one let's try it out so uh, what do, what we will do is go ahead and create go ahead and create a uh, area 2d so first we'll go to the uh uh we'll go to collectible and uh, add a area 2d loader with a college and we'll add a sprite So we'll add to this texture. We'll go to the area 2D here. We'll go to area 2D. We'll rename it to spikes. And we'll go to the collision shape of that body. And first of all, we'll make sure that it's going there. Um, we'll go there. We'll add this. And let's make it a bit more darker. A bit, bit more like that, okay? So now we'll take the sp uh, take the well, I take the spikes and click on this so it like stays together. Oh goodness sake! Come on, man. Hmm. We'll go ahead and put it right here. Okay. After you put that right here, we'll go to click on this and we'll go to. Uh, down and in the script we'll go to click create new script and we'll rename it to spikes.gg and we hit create. Now there's one uh, one I already created where it's spikes.gg or something but that didn't work so we'll go to spikes.gg new. First of all we want to make sure that it, it uh, like inherits from node. So what we'll do is go to click on body entered right here and we'll click on connect. And we'll click uh, the spikes himself. We'll click on connect. We'll say on spikes body entered. So we something entered the body. It's so simple. We, if you want to reload our scene, the first thing you need to do is just get the tree, the tree node of the scene. So we'll go to get underscore tree. What this will do is go to here. Now, why it's useful? Now, it will go to the world node, and it will then we're gonna use the change scene function to change the scene. So, if you don't use this to get tree, it will not get the scene. We'll go change scene, and we will uh, sorry, not change scene. We'll say reload current scene. So what it's doing is just simply restarting the body. So that's how simple it is. That's how easy it is. So we'll click on the uh, our spikes and we'll add that. Now let's try that out. So we go ahead to close it. There you go. It restarts. So boom, boom. There you go. It, it it restarts the game. So that's it for today. And this is the uh, a video I made about my subscribers and how he commented about making a video on spikes. But I was really really stupid and I c I couldn't figure it out how why why it's like it's not happening there. So I finally figured that out and make sure you subscribe to the channel and peace.